It's a national icon, an engineering masterpiece, and a war winner. For a decade, the Spitfire lit up the skies. The British Spitfire had proved to be one of the deadliest weapons ever put in the hands of man. Through six years of war, hundreds of pilots gave their lives, and the Spitfire has become a symbol of their sacrifice. They just stand for courage and victory and all those kind of things. Now, at one of Britain's greatest wartime airfields, it's being brought back to life. There I was, sitting there in amongst a 12 grand lump of wreckage, basically, but feeling quite pleased with myself that I now owned a Spitfire. Over the course of nine months, we're following a small team of engineers as they rebuild a very unusual Spitfire. You're not going to see an aircraft in this place here, ever. They'll be using many of the same plans, tools and methods as their 1940s counterparts. Ah. And scouring the country for as many original components as they can find. I want 15 grand. But they're on a budget, they're on a deadline. Got to do it today, otherwise um, we look like a bunch of idiots. And that plane has got to fly. 